Hello, my name is Marius and I'm a final year mechatronics and robotics student at the University of Sheffield. Currently undertaking my final year project, which is called Surface Electromyography Signal Classification for Controlling a Prosthetic Hand. Now, that seems like a quite a long name, so let's try and break it down. So what is a surface electromyography signal, or EMG for short? Well, when you want to move any muscle in your arm, your brain generates electrical signals that go through your spinal cord and are then passed to the individual muscle fibers to perform the action or gesture that you want with the help of neurons. Since these signals are electrically generated, it is possible to measure them with the right kind of sensor. And this is where the Maya alarm band comes in which does not need any preparation of the skin, as you can simply put it on and record the EMG signals. Okay then, what about classification? Well, when you perform some kind of action involving your muscles, different muscle groups are being activated depending on what you're doing. And if you look closely at the live acquisition of EMG data, you can start to recognize patterns in the signals that you're observing. However, sometimes those are not really recognizable and you don't really want to manually look at each gesture. I mean, you surely have better things to do, right? <clears throat> Therefore, you employ a computer to do the dirty work for you by using machine learning. So now we know what EMG is and what I mean by classification. So the only thing left to explain here is what I mean by controlling the prosthetic hand. Well, what I mean is this. The essence of the project was to acquire EMG signals, pass them through to the machine learning algorithms which would then classify gestures performed by the user and replicate them on the prosthetic hand prototype. Now, you might be wondering why is this useful? Well, for prosthesis users. It's estimated that over 18,000 upper extremity amputations are made every year. And I strongly believe that Technology has progressed far enough to allow us to start replacing lost limbs to the extent where previous functionality can be fully restored. You might say that there are quite a few prosthetics that are already really good, and you would be right. But, EMG classification has not caught up with the functionality that prosthetic arms can provide. In fact, a lot of researchers do not agree on the best procedures or classifiers to use while classifying EMG signals. Therefore, this project aims to add to the research already made to show that EMG classification can easily be achieved by a relatively low-cost acquisition device, the Mayo armband, which would mean more affordable prosthetics for everyone. 